In today's video, I'm going to be showing you the most free-to-play way to obtain hacker keys inside of Pet Simulator 99. So make sure to stick around till the end if you want a way to potentially earn the huge hacker axolotl from the hacker chest. If you want to enter any future huge giveaways, make sure to follow these four steps. Number one, you want to like the video as always. Next, you want to subscribe to the channel because if you aren't subscribed, you are not going to win any huge pets. Number three, you want to watch the video all the way till the end so you don't miss out on the best ways to get OP inside of Pet Simulator 99. And last but not least, number four, you want to comment down your roblox username uh, for a chance to win the huge pet and with that good luck all right so here we go we are going to be pretty much in this last area of the hacker world because this is pretty much going to be the best place you can actually get the most amount of hacker keys and you know it's pretty much the same as the pay to win way there's actually two things that i forgot to mention in that video that i will cover today so it's going to pretty much apply both the pay to win people and free to play but before we get into that, uh, let's just go right into our inventory and we want to go into the potions. So for the potions, same exact thing. You want to do damage potions and treasure hunter potions, two most important. You could use cocktail as well. Uh, and also you can use some coin potions if you don't have any coin uh, enchants equipped. You can just do the coin potions. Uh, and then over here in the uh, enchants, pretty much the same loadout as with the seashells, I believe, and the prison keys. Uh, you want a treasure hunter, a criticals book, a strong pets book. I mean, if your pets are way strong, like if they're super strong, you could just replace this with something else. I'm not sure what else you could have. Maybe, you know, a coins book or another, like, uh, what do you call it? The treasure hunter book. Um, yeah, you could pretty much replace with any of those. And you also want happy pets because it's going to pretty much make your pets attack a lot quicker. Speed book because it's going to increase your pet speed. And then a magnet 3 because it's going to help you collect, uh, you know, I guess the drops and all the coins and all the loot. Uh, and then also the super magnet. It's pretty much like the super magnet counterpart, uh, the magnet 3. And then this is pretty much all of the, that we have right here. Uh, six slots these uh, three at the bottom we're not going to touch because you know if you're free to play you're not going to even be able to get any of them and moving on to ultimates you pretty much want to have a good ultimate i don't really know like the best one for this but you could uh use a, a tornado is good but it is seven million robux i don't know how many of you actually have that tnt shower though i do recommend it's under a million and it actually does it, it's pretty much almost like a pretty much like a free uh tnt crate so yeah pretty amazing uh also make sure you use tnt crates and tnts if you're having some trouble uh actually you know breaking these breakables and also use maybe strength flags as well but the three flags that I recommend you use the most is going to be either shiny uh or rainbow flags these two are going to help with actually like breaking the breakables a lot faster and then the most important one is the exotic treasure flag because it is going to substantially increase drops so you pretty much want to have that and then same thing as the pay to win way you want to have all of your pretty much buffs equipped including fruits and toys so make sure to have all of them on like some of them don't really matter but just have all of them on because why not i mean i have way too many like i have like 30,000 something so yeah that's why i always keep them on and so this brings us to the two things that i forgot to mention in my previous video so the first thing is that there's actually a friend boost when you actually get hacker keys similar to what they did with the prison keys i believe you can have up to three friends like that's the max boost that you can get collect uh i believe it's like 30 percent more drops so make sure to have uh pretty much three friends in your server if you don't have any you know friend like if you only have like one friend or two you could add to other people like just add random people i mean like friend request to random people in roblox isn't bad anyways because i mean that's how i guess how you, how you meet new people so yeah i mean if you want if you want an extra boost make sure to just i guess add uh people i won't do that right now because i mean my my friend my friend list is almost full and so the second thing i forgot to mention is that there's going to be a uh, hacker key surge in pretty much any of these areas so you pretty much just want to uh sometimes go around each of these areas to pretty much just spot uh wherever a hacker key surge is and so as you can see i just came over here and there we go there was actually a hacker surge and it just ended so i'm like really unlucky yeah these hacker surges i believe like they, they're like only around like 10 minutes or something so you really want to go around and just spot wherever one is it can also be in like the center map so keep that in mind uh but sometimes there's actually just i don't I, sometimes there might not even be one so pretty much you just want to keep your eye out pretty much like keep your eye out on like the text the, over here at the bottom because it's going to tell you when the next hacker key search pops up and it gives you two times hacker keys which is insanely op and then also make sure to open up your hacker chest as much as possible because you can actually get um a hacker like enchant from this and if you get like this hacker enchant you're going to be able to get hacker keys a whole lot faster which is potentially going to get you uh these huge pets right here as you can see but if you want to know the best way to collect all three currencies and the void world make sure to check out this video right here